is a video tutorial for the Happy Days Ice Cream Cozy and this is how you make it. This is what you'll need. Fabric for the lining, fabric for the outer and some fusible fleece interfacing. And this is how you make it. Using your template Cut one outer and one lining and apply fusible interfacing fleece to the back of your lining. Take your lining fabric, the piece with the fleece attached to it, and fold in half. Make sure that all your edges line up and then pop a few clips along this edge and this edge. Once you've clipped those two sides, clip the other two. But on this one, on your last one that you do, we've got to leave a gap. So, however you mark a gap, you've got to have a gap about there. So, once you've clipped it all together, it'll look like this. And then we're going to take it to the sewing machine and use a quarter of an inch seam allowance. We're going to sew along the first seam along this one and stop, leave a gap and then sew again to the top, all the way along that one and all the way along that one. I've sewn along the four sides and I remember to leave a gap I'm going to put this to one side while we we'll work on the outer. Now take your outer fabric and fold right sides together as we did for the lining and place some clips along that side and along that side. Now once you've done those two you've got to do the other two exactly the same as we did for the lining. Match up the seams, the, the edges and pop a couple of clips in. And this one as well. We don't leave a gap in the outer and once you've clipped all the way around we're going to sew along each of the four seams as we did for the lining. I've sewn the four seams and now I'm going to turn it the right way. There. Next Take your outer and place it inside the lining that you made earlier. I placed the outer inside the lining right sides together. I've matched up all the seams, the side seams, and I've ma matched up all the edges and clipped into place. And now I'm going to take it over to the sewing machine and I'm going to sew all along each of the pointy sides all the way down and back there. I've sewn all around each of the four pointy bits and I've snipped each of the corners to give a better finish once we turn it the right way and now I'm going to turn it through the gap I left in the lining. 
I've sewn up the gap and I'm going to pop the lining inside the outer. And that's your ice cream cosy all finished. You can of course use it for hot pot noodles and not just cold ice cream. There you go.